Good morning and welcome to, to everyone for this uh, focus session on, on ECMS. I hope you hear me well. For, for once, I'm, I'm dialing in from home and I hope that the Wi-Fi will, will stand the, 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 um, the discussion. Um, today, we expect more than a thousand uh, participants in this session. Uh, another interesting statistics, and thank you for Eli, uh, uh, to Eileen for, for giving that to me. Uh, we have over 35 countries connected and more than 600 institutions uh, uh, registered for this event. And we know that many others will very likely also follow via the, the live stream, uh, as you said, uh, Eileen. Uh, I must say I'm not surprised of this interest because uh, we are now five months from, from going live uh, with the CMS. There is a lot of work being done uh, on all sides. And I hope that this session will be useful for you from the perspective of giving you the um, fresh information on the status of the project and also giving you, uh, uh, well, this is more or less a unique occasion for you to raise any question that you may have and that would help you uh, getting ready for our deadline on the 18th of November this year. Uh, this is our fourth uh, focus session. The last one, if I'm not wrong, was in January. And um, as, you, as you know, we have a, a good tradition of uh, very interactive sessions. So I hope it will stay like that. And uh, so do not hesitate, as Eileen mentioned to you already, uh, do not hesitate to ask questions. We are here for that. Um, you have the chat and of course the, the email address, um, I repeat, mip.events at ecb.europa.eu. And uh, again, we will do our best to take those, uh, most of those questions uh, on the spot during the, the session. Let, let, me now, let me now spend a few minutes on the, the status of the projects. Um, as said, we are five months uh, away from our sh uh, scheduled go live on the 18th of November. Uh, the central bank testing, so the test done by the central banks is progressing well. It's maybe not as advanced as we would have wanted, it, but it's really uh, in a good shape. Um, we have also completed a very large uh, portion of the non-functional tests that, that we have to do, and that's also a good, a good result. And we are also well advanced with our operational readiness. You, you know that uh, the production uh, system is already uh, in place. We have already started connectivity testing and we are also in the process of completing all the um, uh, operation tests that we need to do uh, before go live. Um, on the side of the users, the community testing is also progressing well. Uh, the vast majority of the function domains have been released for testing. And here the rationale that we follow is that we must reach sufficient um, progress and, and sufficient um, uh, confidence in the quality of the software before releasing uh, uh, it for you to test. Um, in this respect, I want to thank you already because there is, we have seen in the, over the past month, a lot of activity on the test environments and thank you for that. Uh, it is fair to say now that the last week have been much less active because for most of you, it was not possible to do the testing. The reason for that, is that uh, we um, we are in the process of doing a migration rehearsal. We call it MT9 for migration test nine. Uh, it's ongoing. What, what I can share with you today is that the, the pre-migration work is now completed. It was a lot of work, but uh, everything went uh, very smoothly. And we are now preparing for the migration weekend, which is coming very, very soon. Uh, and we also expect that to be to be smooth. The colleagues will tell you more about that in a minute. Um, concretely, the test environment will be reopened on the 1st of July, so not far from now. And we expect the test to resume from that point onwards. And actually, we, we expect a peak of activity. We, we, we really encourage you to do as much testing as you can, and also to reach out to the national service desks when you face issues or when you feel the behavior of the system is maybe not exactly what you would have expected. Uh, on our side, uh, although it's, it will be summertime very soon, uh, we have organized that all teams are there, I must say, combat ready to take any question or any uh, challenge uh, you would give them. Um, a few words on the casting for the session today. Um, 
We will start with Audrey. Uh, Audrey will walk us through the planning. So she will share with us some insights on the timeline and the key milestones for the for the uh, between now and go live. Uh, I'm also convinced that uh, with her, I dare to say, limitless uh, functional expertise. I'm sure that Audrey will also take her share of the questions uh, across the, the, the focus session now. Um, then we will continue with Bobby and Bamini for a, a deep dive into testing. Um, and then Anaisa will cover, uh, I mean, she's actually the master of ceremony for the migration on our side. And then Bobby, Bamini and Anaisa will share for you, uh, to you uh, with you, sorry, all possible uh, practical information that will help you understanding uh, in, in very concrete terms what is, what is expected uh, from you in the coming month. Um, in principle, there is no question they cannot answer. So, so uh, feel free to, to raise every, every point that you have in your mind. Um, again, we, we value a lot um, the interaction. So the value of these sessions increase a lot when, when we get a lot of questions. And we will do whatever we can. Use the chat again and the email address that, that we shared with you a bit earlier. Um, so now it's great time probably that I uh, share, uh, that I give back the floor to the, the next presenter. I wish you a, a fruitful session today. I will stay in the background and I will contribute uh, whenever relevant. And I will come back at the end for um, a few closing remarks. Um, I think Aline mentioned it already, uh, this event is recorded. You can see the recording on our website at a later point in time. And also all the slides will be shared uh, on the website. And with that, I believe I'm done, Aline. So I give you the floor back. Yeah, thank you.